All right, guys, Steven from KR Motorsports back again. We've got our Fuel Tech ECU. We're working on a our fabrication guy's 2003 Tundra. So I just wanted to show you guys really quickly here. We have this hooked up extremely basic. So we've got power and ground here, running straight to battery, just to test, just like my other video with the Mega Squirt. And we're gonna walk over to this other side. So like in my other video, I told everyone how you guys need to wire everything up just to test it. We have this patch harness here. Uh, so this patch harness has the fuel tech cam and crank wires going splicing in line the stock ECU is back there it's really hard to see but it's plugged in so uh, because this truck is still automatic we're running a dual ECU setup and so just like I tell everybody when you're trying to do something crazy you need to do the bare minimum to get this thing to see if it works so we have cam and crank hooked up it's going straight to the fuel tech we have constant power and ground on the fuel tech so the fuel tech's not even hooked up to key on power or anything like that, it's just straight power. Again, this is the bare basics to get it going. So we're gonna fire this thing up, and if everything goes well, we'll have RPM, and voila. So we have RPM on the fuel tech. So nothing else is wired up. We've got nothing, no injectors, no coils, nothing is wired up. We're just testing to see if we can get RPM signal. As you can see, we've got RPM signal here, uh, 900 RPM or so, matches the dash. So we're good to go here and ready to move forward.